This is Deb from Deb's Days. Today we're talking about the promenade deck on Princess Cruises Royal Class Ships. Before I get started, I publish new content frequently, so be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And check out the cruising resources section of debsdays.com. You'll find cruise tips, trip reports, ship and port specific information, plenty of photos, and much more. If you've sailed with Princess Cruises before, you know most ships have a walkable promenade deck. It's nice and wide. You can walk front to back, back to front, sometimes all the way around. There's plenty of seating, teak furniture, padded loungers, and it's a covered area. Well, on the Royal Class ships, you don't find a walkable promenade deck. But there is a promenade deck that most people don't know about. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to find it. If you look at the deck plan of Royal Princess on Deck 7, you really can't tell there's anywhere to get outside. But if you look closer, there are actually six doors that will get you outside to the promenade deck. Let's take a look at two of them outside of crooners on the port side of the ship. They're very well hidden on the deck plan. And even when you go into crooners, they're pretty well hidden. The best door to use is the one right behind the bar. Behind the crooner sign, if you go right around the corner, you'll find the doors. These are automatic doors that'll let you on out. And once you get outside, you have a nice seating area. Plenty of seats, and many times, very empty. You can find the other set of doors at the other end of crooners. These doors are a little more difficult. They are heavy doors. It almost makes it look like they don't want you out there. While it's not closed to passengers, it almost makes you think it is. That also leads you to the nice seating outside there on the port side. Two of the other doors are on the other side of the ship on the starboard side. If you look behind facets there at the Effie shop, it looks like you'll just get to look out some windows. But once you get close to the windows, you're actually going to notice there's more doors. Head out these two sets of doors, and you find another set of seating on the promenade deck on the starboard side. The automatic doors, those are almost even harder to find. Look here right behind the captain's circle desk. Doesn't look like anything's there, does it? Oh yeah, we've got more doors. Not many people know about these doors on the port and starboard side. So if you want promenade deck time, look for those doors. We have two more doors farther back on the ship. Outside of Vista Lounge, on both the port and starboard side, you're going to find some more doors. These doors lead out to some teak furniture. Nice loungers. And again, many times, empty. But if you go even farther back on that section of the promenade deck, it actually takes you to the very aft of the ship, where you'll find just a few more teak loungers. You can't beat the view. Now on the starboard side, we have seen smokers in this area, so do be aware of that. But that's only on the starboard side and only towards those last few loungers at the back. Whether you're lounging in the Caribbean getting some sun or cruising Alaska, these doors will lead you to a promenade deck that most people don't know about. If you have any questions or comments, let me know down below. Or go ahead and stop by debsdays.com and click on that Contact Me tab. I'll be happy to answer any questions about Royal Class ships or any other Princess cruise ship. All right, see you next time.